Helping with kindness. I'll get the tickets. You wait here. Some bread. Uh, bread? Uh, let me see. Uh, after we buy the tickets, uh, we still have one hundred dollars left. Let's go buy some bread. Oh, huh? Excuse me, young man. I just missed the last bus. Now I need to take a cab home, but I don't have enough money. Could I borrow some money from you, please? Well, I only have $100. Is that enough for you? <gasps> yes, that's enough. Thank you so much. Please give me your address and I'll send you the money tomorrow. Oh, don't worry about it. It's okay. No, I can't just take your money. I must repay you. <laughs> Thanks again. Bless you for your kindness. <laughs> Oh no, we don't have any more money to buy bread now. What do we do? Uh... It's okay. We can get something to eat when we get home. And it's more important that the old lady had money for a cab. Generosity is its own reward. You're right. <laughs> 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 Today, it has been reported that fraudsters have been tricking people at the bus station, pretending to borrow money for a cab fare home. Bus station? Do you think that old lady was a fraud? What? Liars? No way, really? Well, I think the old lady lied to us. It's been a whole week, you see. And we haven't gotten our money back. Uh, you're probably right. Uh. Oh, this is terrible. We didn't have money for bread because we lent her money to get home. But it was all a lie. Uh, I feel awful that someone would take advantage of us. Ugh. We should be more careful next time. Uh. And I was so hungry that day. Where's my wallet? Did I lose it? Uh, oh no! Uh. Uh, hello, uh, little boy. Uh, I lost my wallet. Could you lend me fifteen dollars? Huh? Nope. We're no longer helping random strangers. <laughs> Hello, Auntie Wong. Jen Jen, is your brother at home? Yes, he is. Ding ding, Auntie Wong is looking for you. Hello, Auntie Wong. Is this letter yours? The address was wrong, so it was sent to my house weeks ago. I meant to bring it over sooner, but I was too busy and forgot. Ding Ding, I'm really sorry it took so long. Yeah. Huh? It's from the old lady who borrowed money from us at the bus station. It turns out she got her address wrong. <laughs> this is great. The old lady is not a scammer, and she didn't lie to us. Scammer? You mean those people lying to get money at the bus station? I saw that news report, too. We thought the old lady tricked us to get money, so we decided not to randomly help others anymore. But I guess we were mistaken. She just got her address wrong. Uh, do you remember the man on the bus? What man? There was a man who said he lost his wallet and wanted to borrow $15 from us. And we thought he was a liar. So Ding Ding and I didn't lend him the money. Uh, we 
We shouldn't think everyone is out to scam us because we misunderstood the old lady. What if the man really needed the money for the bus fare? Oh, I see. It's right to be cautious. And there are people that lie to take advantage of others' kindness. However, we shouldn't lose hope in humanity and become unwilling to help people. I believe that most people are kind, and there are many people that truly need our help. We should give them a hand. Exactly! We shouldn't refuse to help others because we were tricked. It's not fair to those who really need help. And in any case, the old lady didn't lie to us. But we still need to be careful and provide assistance to people within our abilities. That is enough. We understand. We understand. Thank you, Auntie Wong. <laughs> <laughs> then we should continue to help people. That's right. Have others taken advantage of your kindness before? You must have felt so frustrated at that moment and decided you didn't want to trust people anymore. But do we really decide to stop helping others just because of some bad experiences? There are many people who need our help, and we shouldn't be reluctant to lend a hand as long as it is within our ability to do so.